guys to be part of of um, rededicating your vows and uh, to be part of you as well. Uh, let's have a short prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you and praise you for this day, this day you've made, we rejoice in it. And we ask that you settle down a bit and, and just allow you to, to uh, sweep a double portion of your anointing upon us and especially upon David and Paul as they, as they uh, we dedicate to God. We love you, Jesus. We praise your holy name. We bless you. Amen. This may be a little different. I have picked and chose some scripture um, to explain to us as a reminder uh, to all of us to rededicate our lives to Jesus every day and uh, to rededicate our vows to one another as a married couple. And uh, so if you would like to join hands with us, I see everybody already are, so you're right on. And uh, is, my, is my wife here? Yes. Would you like to join join me, darling? <laughs> My hand reaches out to you. But it's, I don't know, I really believe that it can be, be just as special as David and Nicole of uh, start their uh, marriage. Uh, Song of Solomon 15, 16. This is my beloved, this is my friend. Uh, we're gathered here at the house of the Lord in Lancaster, PA, to celebrate David and Nicole's vows, commit to, that they committed to themselves to one another, joining together in holy matrimony before God and you, the family of the uh, their dearest friends, to be here. Many of you are family. David and Nicole wishes to invite all the married couples to hold hands. So they are to be before God and these witnesses to take this woman to be your lawful wedded wife, to love and respect her, honor and cherish her in health, in sickness, in richer and in poor. In leaving all others to keep yourselves up, to keep yourself only on to her as long as she goes for you. I do. Uh, Nicole, do you like matter solemnly agree to receive this man as your lawful wedded husband? To love, to respect him, to love, or, or, and to live with him in all faith and tenderness in health and sickness, in richer or poorer, and leaving all others to keep yourself only unto him as long as you both should. Before God and these witnesses, to be your 
loving and faithful wife. In plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health, as long as we both show it. Step out in faith, not really knowing what's going to happen, but knowing that they desire one another, and knowing that that you are bigger than that you can fix things in time of trouble. So, Father, we ask, Holy Spirit, that you would anoint this couple, and we. Pray that you give them a double portion of your love and teach them that you're a godly love for one another. That no matter what, that we committed ourselves to you, first of all, and then to one another. And Father, I ask that, that you, you put your arms around them and that your, your covering will be upon them at all times. And Father, we also ask that you reach out to the relatives, to the parents, to our loved ones, friends and our neighbors. And Father, if there's anything tugging in, in our hearts today, we ask that you fix it. If there's pieces are missing, we ask that you would make it. We ask this in your precious name. Bless my brother for the music, and bless all the ones that have helped put, put this day together. We love you and we praise you all the way. Amen. This is a song that I sang at my own wedding almost 11 years ago. It's still pretty current.
<laughs> okay. I'm with the guitar. Round with two. The guitar <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Round the guitar. Stay inside. Okay. You want to come out in the sun a little bit? Come out in the sun. Stay in the sun. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Get in the middle of it. You're not in the middle. Okay, that's better. Oh, okay, Linda, hurry up your arms in my way. <laughs> Nikki, turn around and smile. <laughs> All right, now. <laughs> Nikki, smile. David, David, look this way. You're looking two different directions. Everybody. All the camera people line up on the floor. <laughs> A lot of the seasonal, a lot of seasonal needs that they use, a lot of it is because of um, the benefits you don't have to pay for. And just payrolling, payrolling quotas. Well, that's a song. If you leave a job and you go to another city, you know, it's crazy. Then, like, You want to say anything to the camera? Hi. It'll live forever. <laughs> That's excellent. Yeah. Lots of children. Well, the salads are all gone. That's what's left. All photographers? Way out there. Okay, everybody. Okay. Toast to the host. That, that's, that's poetry. Life, life, liberty. Hi, Ontario. The pride of Ontario. Hi, Ontario. The pride of Ontario. The pride of Ontario. Never heard that one. That's the a groom first. feeds the bride. <laughs> the groom feeds the bride. Hi, Ontario. The groom feeds the bride. They ought to have a plate. Somebody ought to give them a plate. <laughs> You need a plate. Give him a small plate. <laughs> Give him a plate. There you go. Okay, no mess now. Now you need two plates, one for each. Two nice. Two hands. Oh, yeah. Here we go, Daniel. Uh, get the picture. I like it. Woohoo! 
done with the plumbing. Oh, just run out. <laughs> what what is lucky? He has experience. Are they done? Rehearsed. Long time ago at uh, uh, Aunt Helen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> y'all paying attention? Yes. Look what I said, y'all. That's good. Yeah. 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 New Jersey wall, huh? <laughs> I'd sleep on the floor if it meant you have a bed. Here, take my place to rest your weary head. No, it's no trouble, you're worth it to me. For the sinful reasons that you are family. And that's what you mean to me. Just because you are my family. That's what you mean to me.